another day, another bank switching offer. After a pretty lean summer, they are back with a vengeance. And this latest one is from Lloyds Bank, and it is worth a very, very tasty £200. And this one starts on the 2nd of October 2024 and runs all the way through until early December. So there is plenty of time to take advantage of this one and get the cash if you are eligible. Now, as ever, when I take you through these offers, you can find more information, full analysis, read over things again over in the article, becleverwithyourcash.com. So head over there and you'll find uh, this and all the other switching deals in far more detail. But let's take you through step by step what you need to do to get this money. First of all, though, let's kick off with who can get it? Can you get it if you're an existing Lloyd's customer? Yes, you can. Can you get it if you're a new Lloyd's customer? Yes, you can. Can you get it if you've had money from Lloyd's before? No, you can't. Well, let's start off first of all with the easiest of those ones if you are a new customer, right? Very simply, you need to open up a new Club Lloyd's current account, a Club Lloyd's silver current account, or a Club Lloyd's platinum current account. One of those brand new, and you must start opening that from the 2nd of October onwards. If you did it on the 1st of October or the 30th of September or whenever it was before, you're still going through the process, you won't count. It has to be brand new on or after the 2nd of October. Okay, so uh, open up that brand new account and then switch into it from a different bank. Now, I'll come back to the next steps after that in a minute because let's go back to if you're an existing Lloyd's customer. Now, if you're a Lloyd's customer who doesn't have one of those three accounts, then it's really simple as well because you can open up one of those three accounts as a new brand one, new one. You can have it alongside whatever existing account you've got right now and then switch into it from a different bank. Now, very, very important here is you must open up a brand new account. You cannot upgrade your account and be eligible for this offer. I mean, you physically can go in and upgrade the account. If you do that, it will not count as a new account and you will not be eligible for the cash. So really, really important if you have any other kind of Lloyd's account that you open up brand new, apply for it brand new within the app, in-store, online, however it is, as a new account. Now, what happens if you're an existing customer who already has one of those accounts? Well, there's a problem here because you can only have one Club Lloyd's account. It's not like Halifax where you can have a number of reward accounts or whatever it might be. You can only have one. Now, you've got a few options here. If you've got the standard Club Lloyd's account or you've got one of the two packaged accounts, I'm pretty confident you can open one of the other two. So you've got the Club Lloyd's standard account. You can open up the Club Lloyd's Silver or the Club Lloyd's Platinum account. Okay, should let you do that and vice versa. Or your existing Club Lloyd's account, the other option here is you downgrade that to a standard Lloyd's bank account. That's really simple to do in the app, really fast. And then you go, as with all the ones I've already explained, then you open up the brand uh, new Club Lloyd's, Club Lloyd's Silver or Club Lloyd's Platinum account. And both of those ways will help you get around it if you're already an existing Club Lloyd's account holder. Uh, the problem you've got with a downgrade option, of course, is this will stop any of the benefits you currently have as a Club Lloyd's customer. So you're getting your free Disney Plus, you're getting your free cinema tickets, your free magazine subscription, you've got access to that 6.25% paying regular saver. So these are all great benefits you get from Club Lloyd's accounts. They'll all stop. Now, obviously, you get in the new account, you can start them again, but it's just there can be a delay there, a month delay before those lifestyle benefits kick in. Uh, the interest account, obviously, that's going to be a problem. You might not be working quite as smoothly as you wish for that, maybe lose out on something there. So it is something to bear in mind if you're going to do that downgrade option and open up uh, a brand new version uh, separately. Uh, so anyway, that's you can get it. Now, the third thing we talked about there was, what if you've already had money from Lloyd's before? There was a cutoff date here. If you have had money from Lloyd's, or Halifax, or there's a new one this time, Bank of Scotland, because they're all part of the same banking group, since April of 2020, then you are not going to be eligible for the cash this time, even if you have managed to open up a new Club Lloyds account. If you've had the money in the last four and a half years from any of those banks, you will not be able to get it this time. Okay, so that's the kind of eligibility, who can do it and how to do it. But let's assume you are able to do this. You're able to open up that brand new account, that Club Lloyds account or silver or platinum. And then you start that switch. Often you do that as part of the process, but you can obviously do it afterwards if you wish. Um, you've got to do it obviously before that end date in December. You have to switch using the current account switching service and that will close the old account you switch from. And that must be from a non-Lloyds account. You can't switch from a Lloyds account into a Lloyds account. Must be a different bank. 
However, that does not exclude Halifax or Bank of Scotland. So you could switch one of those accounts in and that would be fine. Any other bank would be absolutely fine as well, uh, as long as it's part of that current account switch service. So really, it rules out. Who does that rule out? Revolut, probably the main one that'd be ruled out there. Um, then also, the old account that you're switching from has to have three direct debits, active direct debits in that account. Now, this is where the kind of, you've got a couple of months taking advantage of this um, switch might come into play. So potentially that old account, you might need to be setting up those direct debits ASAP. You've got time to do this and to carry added to the account and be paid out of the account. Most normal direct debits, uh, whether you want to move over your TV license or your mobile phone bill, or whether you want to set up something specifically, will be done within sort of a month, okay? Um, sometimes they take a bit longer, maybe the charity ones. Sometimes they can be faster. And don't forget, there is a separate piece of content, an article, a video, podcast episode, taking you through some of those fast and cheap direct debits you can set up if you are in need of extra direct debits. But yeah, three of them on this account. Same as when the offer ran earlier this year, but that's you know increasing it from when it used to be just two. Uh, and that's it. Nothing else you need to do. Once that switch completes, you'll get that money relatively quickly. I think it's within three working days of that finishing. So that's, uh, again, money that can come into your account pretty fast. Um, and so the end date for this one, the last date to start the switch is the 10th of December, 2024. So you've got just over uh, two months in order to do all these different stages, open the account, set up those direct debits on the old account if you need to, get the switch to complete, uh, all really nice and simple, and you will be money will be yours in your account. So it doesn't end there though, because what I do want to quickly talk about is which of those three accounts you should be going for, the Club Lloyds, the Club Lloyds Silver, or the Club Lloyds Platinum. Now, the Club Lloyds, what that basically means on each of those different accounts is you will get a lifestyle benefit. And I mentioned that before, it's the like sort of uh, a year of Disney Plus, sadly with adverts as it is, uh, six free cinema tickets, a magazine subscription, or a kind of a gourmet society membership. Whichever one you go for, you get that as have part in that having that account. Um, there is a three pound fee for having any kind of Club Lloyds account every single month, but you can avoid that. And this is really important. You can avoid that by paying 2000 pounds into that account every single month. That £2,000 does not to be, need to be in one go. It does not need to be uh, in the account for any length of time. So you could put two grand in, take it straight back out if you wanted. You could put £200 in, take it back out, pay it back in, take it back out, pay it back in. Do that 10 times, you've hit two grand as that threshold that's required to be in that account, but you've only actually moved £200 around. Okay, do that and that fee is void. So it's really important you do that and don't forget to do that. My person, me personally, with my Club Lloyds account, I have a standing order set up that goes from my main account into that account. That two grand goes in and then it goes off. And in fact, it cycles around some of the other accounts, which also have requirements for a while. So I meet all of those, but I don't do anything. Every month, same thing happens and I avoid that fee every month, which is really, really important. So that's the same for all three of those different accounts. The difference between the Club Lloyds on its own and the silver and platinum is the silver and platinum ones are what's called a packaged account and they come with different insurances added on and you pay more for that. So these prices actually went up just a few months ago. So the silver version is now £11.50 a month and this has European travel insurance as well as uh, breakdown cover and phone insurance. The platinum is £22.50 a month and that's worldwide cover. Again, this is for your family as well. Talked about packaged accounts in more detail again uh, previously, so do check out that content again on the website, in the on the podcast, and on the YouTube channel. We'll take you through all of those. Now, if you sign up for the, one of those accounts now, maybe because you can't get the other one, the Plain Club Lloyds, and you go for one of these, uh, you don't have to keep doing it. Once you've got that cash, you can downgrade that account back down to the free version or just to a normal uh, Lloyds account if you wish. And when you do that, it could well be that you don't pay that fee at all. If you do this quick enough within the space of like a calendar month, it might be you don't pay anything at all and completely avoid that fee. So you get that full 200 pound switching offer. Or worst case scenario, if it takes a little bit longer, maybe you pay one month, maybe two months of that fee, but then you can downgrade it. Now, obviously, if you're going to do that, you aren't taking one of these packaged accounts because you want the insurances. The obvious one to go for is the silver over the platinum, yeah, because it's cheaper by uh, 11 pounds uh, uh, every single month. So absolutely, that would be a priority over the platinum if you're doing it just for the switching bonus rather than just continue to get it. The silver also has a benefit over some of the other packaged accounts out there in that it is slightly cheaper than all the rest because it is just European cover rather than worldwide cover. So if you don't go outside of Europe, that's probably one of your best options out there. Uh, whereas the platinum one, worldwide, 
but that is very expensive compared to some of the other options out there. So if you are actually after a packaged account, I might be looking elsewhere, even though Nationwide's going up in December, and I'm sure others will all follow suit as well, uh, they still will be saving you some money every single month on what you get there. Of course, they do vary, and it's obviously worth checking each of these packaged accounts uh, with Lloyds or elsewhere to see if they suit your situation. So just briefly summarize here, out of those three, Club Lloyds are the best one for most people, potentially silver, potentially platinum if you actually really need it. Uh, but don't forget, with all three of those, to make sure that £2,000 goes in every month to avoid that £3 Club Lloyds fee. Uh, very quickly as well, last thing to say about these accounts, obviously there's £200 switching off. I mentioned the lifestyle benefit, you can get the streaming or cinema tickets. But there's also, I did talk about this briefly before, there is a 6.25% paying regular saver that comes with this account. Now that is not the highest paying regular saver out there, but it is fixed, so it's locked in for the year. So if rates do fall elsewhere, you're definitely going to be get it. It's still a very good rate, 6.25%. Plus, this is the one that lets you put the most money in every single month. You could put £400 in every month, which is at least 100 quid more than the next best one, potentially though 150, 250 more than what you're going to see elsewhere. So again, it is a good one to consider in the mix, either instead of or as well as uh, another regular saver that's also linked to a current account at a different bank. Have, again, I've covered regular savers. If you're not sure how they work, cover them in more detail as well. My name is Andy Webb. Thank you so much for watching this. Check out these videos here for more ways to make the most from your bank.